Welcome back everybody, Kenny Spison here. I do put out Starfield content every week, so be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And what are we looking at here, the most ridiculous ship you've ever seen? Well, a few weeks back on the Fallout Feed podcast, host Ray uh, made the point that they don't have any kind of a showroom inside the game for you to know what's inside the module. So I'm going to do a showroom of every module throughout the game uh, over the next several weeks. Starting today with all the 2 by one all-in-one berths. And what I've done was I've put all of the the bottom layer will be the berths with no windows so you can see exactly what's supposed to be in it. And then up top, a full complement of windows so that way you can see if there's any clutter or debris that might be left behind. Worth kind of noting when you're trying to um, have a, a ship that has a little more flavor to it and flair. Uh, we are going alphabetical here from Deimos to Hope Tech to Nova Galactic. Uh, Stroud, and then on to the Teo. Now, I'm not going to go through all of those Teos because they're actually all like, identical. Um, um, but like these ones here are the bottoms, uh, so that you like you can't put anything on the sides. Nice curved look. That's the mid, and then we got the tops over here. So we're going to go ahead and hop into it. I will put timestamps in the video description for you guys, so that way you can hop forward to the habitats you want to check out specifically. Uh, to start with, of course, we're in the demos. We're in the back of it. Got a table there, along with the uh, the bathroom in there, and beds in the middle. Galley up front, and I think it's the only one that has a television at the table in the berth. The living quarters all do, but as far as the berths, I think this is the only one that has a uh, TV. Be nice if it was on, but I digress. And when we place a bunch of windows, we still have a couple things, which is nice. A little bit of a little bit of clutter there and you still have that one random table in the back so it would be nice uh, if a chair was actually in fact I think if you only have one of those windows I think you will still have a chair there all right next up we are going to look at our hope tech which hope tech has the most kind of cluttered lived in look it's a little disheveled chairs aren't pushed in too straight, items on the floor. Beds, of course, in the back with the bathrooms, which for those of you who like that idea, it's actually pretty, pretty useful. Let's see what we have up top here. So we still have a little shelf, a chair, and a couple boxes right there. And the, this back section here, or front section actually, I think, yeah, front section is completely cleared out if you put all your uh, windows and doorways block open and everything up. All right, next up we are going to be looking at Nova Galactic, which is basically the frontier. You got your navigation table, your little kitchen table with your galley over there. Now what's interesting is, look at this corner, pay attention to this corner right here. There's just nothing there. Um, and then now up front, uh, that's what it looks like <laughs> on that wall, which most people don't see because that's the, where you go into the cockpit on the frontier itself. But remember that corner I told you about? This is really interesting. They actually had something back there, it's like this counter that's not there for some reason, uh, which is kind of cool, though, if you, you know, do have windows and doorways up here. But... All you have after putting everything in is your table, your navigation table, and your galley. You lose your bed right there and everything else. Oh, and there's a little shelf thing right counter right there too. Interesting. Alright. Now we're gonna look at our what are we gonna do? Nova Galactic. Oh, Stroud Eklund, my personal favorite. Got the shower in the back here. This random table, which would be nice if they had a chair right where that box is, but whatever. It's got the most kind of storage cargo look to it. Bed's in the middle. I like how this one's kind of nice and dark, more moody. Uh, I've got our galley in the back. And the Stroud Eklund is the only one I think you can flip, so you can put the shower over on that side if you need to. Sometimes you'll come across a ship where that's useful. Actually, I like having my showers in all of my ships as best as possible. And up top, what do we got? Uh, we've got our some boxes there, a little trash can there, little box there, big box there, a little pail, and 
little container right there. Okay. And lastly will be our Teo. Right, Teo? That's Stratoc Land. Yep, Teo is up this way. Now the Teo is basically a reskin of the Hope Tech. It's just lighter in color. So the beds are at the back. Pretty much everything is the same. Green chairs instead of yellow. It's got that disheveled look. Just like the Hope Tech does. Alright. And I think it's going to be the same up top where you have that chair. Yep. The chair, the boxes, that little shelf thing. And then the front gets completely cleared out. All right, folks. Well, I hope you enjoyed this, and I'll continue putting these showroom videos out. Uh, other than that, folks, take care, and I will see you in the waste <laughs> wasteland. See you in the starfield. <laughs>